Whoa, that's some kind of that's some kind of organ that just popped out of that one. Hey friends, recently I've been getting into growing a planted tank. There's some Java fern down there. Java fern window love variety and some pond snails. You can see all the babies along that piece of driftwood there. That's oak. All those little dots are snail babies. And I want to bring you in close here to check out these pond snail babies. And you see this white layer right there? That's all zooplankton. I believe they're called cepapods or something of that such. But check this out. Those are baby snails. And look at all that zooplankton. This tank is just teeming with life, microscopic life. I believe those are also cephapods, sepapods. If you know more about these, please post your comments below. They're these tiny white flea-like zooplankton, a very ancient form of life. So the planted tank works that I hardly ever change the water on this. I've got no pump, no filter. And the algae that was covering this tank here, only this one gallon uh, bowl, the, the snails eradicated all the algae within one week. Just a couple snails. I mean, that piece of driftwood was covered in algae, green algae. My next move is going to be to in introduce a fish in here some sort of tiny dwarf um there's several different fish i got to decide what fish to put in there to take care of my snail problem so if you're doing this plant and tank hobby yourself please post your comments how i could do that i also have another a jar here it's a about half gallon mason jar same kind of thing some algae in there and there are some baby snails in here as well as well as the eggs you can see right there. So that's kind of a, uh, a way station for trying to move some of these into another place here until I find um, the proper fish to munch on these things. Look at its mouth. Isn't that amazing? And its tentacles. I believe these two are breeding. They've been glomming on each other for a couple hours going up and down the tank. Check that out, man. That mouth organ constantly moving up and down the tank eating the algae i'll move the jeweler's loop away see what they look like just with the bare eye yeah i could not have made out that mouth though without the jeweler's loop you can really dial in here and observe these animals Whoa, that's some kind of that's some kind of organ that just popped out of that one. That's what's what leads me to believe they're breeding. They're, they're attaching to each other with all kinds of things, different probes and tentacles. Very cool. See that probe right there? Off to the left of the body there. More interesting snail behavior. Breathing on the surface, eating on the surface. You can see there's the snail on the surface of the water in the planted tank. Check out its mouth opening. Closing there. And see they're getting nutrient and or air 